Hello, in this tutorial, I will guide you through the entire process of creating custom items for iClone and Character Creator. The programs we are going to use for this tutorial are iClone, Character Creator, ZBrush and Blender. This is by no means the only way to do custom items for iClone, but it is how I do mine. So let's get started. First thing we want to do is open iClone Carriage Creator. Then click on this icon and for this tutorial I will use a base mail template. So double click on it and it will load the base mail template. Uh, you can customize everything in here but for this tutorial I won't do that just to keep the tutorial short but um, what I will do is open iClone Pro and go to the Actor tab, then open the Head section and choose the Mail folder, then click on any of the icons and choose Find File. This will open a new window and we can now close Icon Pro and let's see. Um, uh, for this one I will choose the M underscore M underscore 006 head. We can leave the default settings and click OK. After uh, the template has loaded, we will save the project and then export as an OBJ file so we can uh, start creating the custom items in ZBrush. As you see, the models are pretty detailed, pretty good models. Uh, you can change everything in here as you wish, but as said, I won't do this for this tutorial. Um, so now we will save this one as a custom project so we can find so we can find it back later click on the plus sign and then give it a name let's call it tutorial and this saves the template so we can import it back later. Next thing, click on File, then Export to OBJ, Nude Character. Leave the default settings and click Export. And I already created a folder on my desktop called Tutorial and I called it Mail Tutorial OBJ. Then save it. And this is, uh, we are done now in Icon Character Creator. Uh, next thing we will do is open ZBrush and import the OBJ file so we can start on some hair for this character. 
keep in mind that um, in the folder where you saved the obj file there is a, a file called um, obj key don't delete it we will need it later when we import our custom items back in iClone character creator that's it for now I will talk to you later bye bye